Okay, we've got our loin split and beat down thin. Next thing we need to do is a bunch of a package of green onions and chop them all up. I only used a half a bag. Uh, you can use as many as you want, but chop them up. You also want to get eight ounces of cream cheese and cut it in half. Okay, and what you do is you take half the cream cheese, half the green onions, and half of the garlic that we uh, roasted. And this is a product that you'll end up with. Mix it all together. And we're going to spread this on the loin. And we'll be back in just a second after we spread this on here. And uh, we'll be back. This is what we end up with as we spread it out. Kind of keep it off of the edges a little bit. Looks pretty good. Right, then what we want to do is we want to roll it up. Kind of keep it tight. I'm going to roll it up. Nice like that. And then this is where, let me wash my hands real quick. Stay sanitary. Okay. okay. Now I'm going to take a little bit of this daddy's, uh, call it uh, Gonzo Sugar Daddy. Where'd you get it? I actually got this uh, at the State Fair. Oh, and, awesome. Uh, uh, I really have grown to like this season. So anyways, I want to sprinkle this on the outside before it gets wrapped with bacon. Okay. And then what you want to do is then you want to take this and bacon wrap it and use toothpicks. I like soaking my toothpicks in water so they don't burn. So uh, I chupacabra on the inside and I put this daddy's on the outside. You can use any seasoning that you would like to do. And then we bacon wrap. And this is what the final product will look like. You should end up with two. Like I said, this is a pork loin that I use, but you can, can use pork tenderloin also. And now what you want to do with these is you either want to grill them indirectly to an internal temperature of 145 degrees minimum or smoke them to 145 degrees same thing and until you're and you know if you need to turn the heat up at the end or whatever to make your bacon a little crispier and uh, hey if I remember we'll show you finished product but uh, I think this is for Sunday after the Cowboys win go Cowboys Man, good stuff. I'll tell you one thing. Bruce got it going over here, and I can't wait to try it out. But this is Barbecue Grill Masters, Big Rome, and Bruce over here doing a fine job over here. Good job. Thank Cheers. You. Cheers. There you Thanks go. Thanks for watching our video. That's right. NTBA, let's go.